Hi, Sally. Good evening. Hi. How are you today, my dear Sally? I am fine. Yeah, okay. Okay, so let us have here. So I hope you're fine and you're doing great. And teacher Anne is so happy to hear that you are doing great and fine. Okay. Now, let us have here you all. Uh, where we are already in unit 12A. Okay. So let us have here the listening for unit 12A. How are you this weekend, Sally? Oh, Ali, why the I forgot. I forgot. We still have one missing activity, a one missing class, right? We did not able to have that. Is teacher correct? Do we need to have one week of class? Yes. Okay. So we uh, no, 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 no. Oh, you were absent yesterday, the last time. Remember? Okay. Can we have the class tomorrow? Tomorrow is Sunday or uh, Monday, right? Monday. Are you free tomorrow? Can we have the class? Yes. Okay. Wait, I will check my Monday. Monday, Monday. Okay. Can we have the class tomorrow at 7 uh, Wait, oh, sorry. Like nine o'clock, can we have the class tomorrow at nine o'clock? Is it okay for you? If you have, if you are free. If you are free, we can have the class. Okay, so now, Saleh, let us have this, okay? Please try to listen this one. Okay. Are you ready, Sally girl? Yes. Okay, thank you, Sally girl. Oh, wait. oh, 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 but this one, we did do it. We did it, we do it already? Yes. Okay, let's move it. Wait, because my mouse isn't good. It's not working properly. Okay. That I hear something, it's uh, it's tickling. Okay, please wait for a minute. It's there, it's here already.
Okay, it's here. You eat your dinner, Sally? Yes. Yes. What is your vine for dinner? Picture is uh what's that? Cookie. Uh teacher Anne is teacher Anne's uh dinner is meat and uh a meat and a rice. A chicken. And and me is a uh, rice, a soup. Um, uh, a salad and a uh, meat. Wow, it's more delicious. You've got many food in the house. Okay, so let us have here. Oh, I like your t-shirt. The color. It's pink. Yeah. yeah, is that your favorite? Yes. Yeah, I think your favorite color is pink. It has always been a pink. You're a pink girl. <laughs> you should be in the black pink. Because you are of a pink course. girl. So you should be in the black pink teacher. Okay, this one. Okay, this one. Let us Did you add? We did this one. This we did this. We did this. The first we one? Oh my god. What happened? Wait, wait for a while. What happened with my laptop? Yes. Yes. Oh, wait for a while. Why? Why happened? Because my laptop keeps on. Okay, so let us have space. Okay, you have here the journey into space. So, how would you like to be? Okay. Astronaut. Uh, you're in the space. You imagine yourself. Oh my God. It's not easy to be in space. Okay. We have here just like first one astronauts. Okay. Astronaut. Planet. 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 Rocket. Planet. Rocket. Rocket. Round. Rocket. Rocket. Ground. 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 Environment. Environment. Temperature. Environment. Temperature. Okay, again, please read it all. Astronaut. Temperature. Temperature. <laughs> then, again, again, please read it again. Sally girl. Astronaut. Next. Planet. Okay, do you know what is astronaut, uh, Sally? Do you know what is this? Who is this, rather? Yes. Know? Yeah. They are the person or people who 
to go to space. Okay, they are so brave enough to go to the space. Okay, remember that when you go to space, it's not an easy job. It's a very hard work. You need to be very fit so that you can go in space. Next is a rocket. Do you know rocket? This is a spaceship. Yes. Ground. A ground yes. is where you yes. step. Okay, like when we stepped, it's a ground environment. It is the place that surrounds us. What is your environment, Oyen? You are living in a city, teacher. My environment yes. is so busy. Okay. Yes. You are living in a city. So your environment is very busy. How about temperature? Temperature. So hot. Hot. Hot, hot. <laughs> it's the hotness and the coldness of an object. Oh, teacher, and I'm hot. I need to have my temperature is too high. It's 45 degrees. I'm burning with a hat. It's very hot. Okay, so you understand all these words? Yes, temperature. Okay, very good. Now, complete the sentences about the picture. Oh. Okay, look at this one. Okay, we have three. Okay, we have here the sentences. Okay, can you please write in here or no? Write in hey, here. Hey, I'm gonna say. Okay, what? Number two. Okay, you read and answer. Two of the astronauts are playing. Playing golf. Okay. Golf. Playing golf. Wow, what's the answer? What's the answer? No, no, no. Here, the answer is in here, in the yellow. Yes, it's golf. Okay, golf. Number three. Can you please read number three? Number three is the rocket door is open. Okay, open. Okay, four. Oh, sorry. <laughs> four. A robot with a square head. Head is watching TV inside the rocket. Five. Square. Five. One of the planets. Head. One of the planets is lar larger than the other two. Okay. Okay, very good. Larger okay, than the other two. We use larger. This is in comparative form. Comparing one planet from the other planet. Okay, five. Oh, sorry, six. The trees have got the leaves that look like little hands. Okay, very good. Seven. Seven. The The stairs, the stairs under the rocket. The rocket the stairs, the, oh, that number one under the stairs. It's a stair. It's the, it's the six stairs. Are you sure number seven stairs also the answer? Yes. Okay, number stairs. one answer is stairs. Can you see number one? Look at number one. <laughs> Number one answer is stairs. The chest, the chest, maybe okay. the chest. The block under the rocket looks like a uh, like a sun. Oh, what is this? What is this? This one. What do you mean by this? This is a uh, 
can you give the answer? It's too hard. Okay, the ground. Okay, the ground under the rocket looks like the sun. Okay, look at this. This one, it looks like the sun. Okay, this is the rocket. Okay, this is where the snow astronauts ride. Okay, you got six over seven. Very good. Okay, I will write your scores here and I will mark six over seven. Good job. I will color it yellow now. Okay, very good. Next one. Okay, look at this, Sally. Oh, this is a challenge. You have to listen to me and listen and write the names. Oh, the names of this astronaut is quite complicated. It's not rare. It's not common. It's rare. Okay, please lesson their name and write it here okay. 12b a journey into space listen and write names can you see the robot in this picture you can good the robot's name is zenith you spell that z e n i f now look at the three astronauts. The one in the middle is behind the net. His name's Yabachi. I'll spell that for you. It's Y-E-B-A-R-C-H-I. The astronaut that's jumping out of the rocket has a really unusual name too. He's called Paviol. That's P A V I O L. Can you see the third astronaut? Again, 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 what? Can you um, let me uh, listen again? Okay, of course. Do not just write your answer in the chat box so you can properly hear. Do not write it here, just in the chat box. I need the spelling, correct spelling, okay? I will let you listen again. Ace. Listen and write names. Can you see the robot in this picture? You can? Good. The robot's name is Zenith. You spell that Z E N I F. Now look at the three astronauts. The one in the middle is behind the net. His name's Yabachi. I'll spell that for you. It's Y E B A R C H I. The astronaut that's jumping out of the rocket has a really unusual name, too. He's called Paviol. That's P A V I O L. Can you see the third astronaut? She's at the front of the picture. Look, she's playing badminton too. Her name's Glustida. Write her name now. You spell it G-L-U-S-T-I-D-A. Oh, oh, Sally. Okay, what? Teacher, the teacher cannot understand this one. He write in the chat box. Better in the chat box. It is easy for you too. This one is hard for you. The okay. spelling, right? Yeah, I told you the the spelling is quite challenging. Their name is not common. <laughs> Yeah, their name, is, their name is not common, okay. 12B, a it's journey into space. It's not on. Oh, listen, listen. Listen and write names. Can you see the robot in this picture? You can? Good. 
The robot's name is Zenith. You spell that Z E N I F. Now look at the three astronauts. The one in the middle is behind the net. His name's Yabachi. I'll spell that for you. It's Y E B A R C H I. The astronaut that's jumping out of the rocket has a really unusual name too. He's called Paviol. That's P A V I O L. Can you see the third astronaut? She's at the front of the picture. Look, she's playing badminton too. Her name's Glustida. Write her name now. You spell it G L U S T I D A. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, ye but she ha ha. Zinef. Okay, let's check the spelling. Oh, 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 oh. Zinef. Okay, can you see that? The spelling is quite uh -huh. common. The name is not common. Okay, do you like your name to be Zinef? <laughs> okay, next. Yebachi. Oh. Yerbachi, Yerbachi. Oh, do you like your name? Yeah. Yerbachi. Oh, I will call you now Yerbachi. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Next. Oh, this is easy. Fabiol and Lostida. Okay. Which of the four names you like most? Lostida. Which of the four name you like most? Uh, I like Glastida. Glastida. Oh, I like, you know what? I like your Oh, <laughs> okay. Now, four or three over four. Yes. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. Very good. Bam, 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 Okay, how many differences can you point? Okay, please underline the differences or in circle. Okay, you can see it in the space. Okay. Sally is happy. I'm done. Oh, so look at that. Oh, so first, if you can see that, what's the difference? You can see, you can see. Yeah, you can see that. Okay. The flowers is growing, but here the flowers isn't have the plant isn't have flowers yet. Okay. And there's a rocket. 
There is no racket. Ooh. Where's my answer? Hey, now here, look at this. So, can you see that? Okay, this is your answer actually. Okay, okay. So I see you have that, but in here it doesn't. Look up, there's a moon, but I haven't seen a moon. Okay, the flowers <coughs> blooming, but in here, oh, it's still small. <laughs> okay, you can see there's a rocket, but in here, this a rocket, and in here, there is a big planet. The planet is just too near. Oh my god, I don't think it is real. That the planet is just maybe, just maybe this is real. Okay, and we have the robot. The robot head is square, but the robot head in here, the robot is cooking, it's round. So you are good, very good with all the, oh, you can see that the astronaut here is sad, but the astronaut in here is happy. Okay, can you see that? And... Okay, so the one you told me are all correct, Sally. They are actually correct. Okay, they are all, oh, what happened? Next here. We only have, we only have uh, 15 minutes okay. left. Okay, so these are the differences that you can see in the pictures two astronauts are playing golf correct these are two trees with leaves the robot is watching inside a rocket okay correct there are three other planets okay correct okay this is the description for each okay this one sorry this one description is under here the other one is in here, right, Sally? Right? Yes, right. Okay. You read the text and choose the right answer. Okay, just in circle this very easy. In circle only, you not need to no need to write, just in circle. Uh the planets will Leave, leave, leave on is called Earth. Earth is one of the one of the eight planets. that move round and round the sun until the 20th century. We didn't have until what's answer? Until 20th, 20th Oh, what's the answer for number one? It's that? That. That. Okay. Number two? Until, until the 20th century, we didn't have any lots. We didn't have no really any good any really good maps of our planet Very but good. now we can take we can take picture of earth with special cameras in space and making maps is easy Hey, very good. Yeah, hey. 
Now, yeah, correct. You've got to have four over four. Is that what are you? What are you singing? Um, my oh, favorite. oh, continue, please continue. You just underline, just encircle. Do not read, just encircle. Just read it later. So you will not feel dizzy. In circle or underline, put a line. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Hey, I'm stuck. Yes. Uh, number five. Many of our planet, most of our planet has water on it. Most? Most. <laughs> oh. In picture, oh, what's the name of our planet? Again, what's the name of our planet? We are living in the planet? It's Earth. Earth. Okay. Looks okay. We are living in a planet Earth. Earth often looks like a big blue and white ball. Okay, but pictures of the Earth don't only help us to make maps. Okay, when we look at them, very good. We can also learn a uh, what a lot about the Earth environment and weather traveling in space and watching other planets helped us to learn more about earth too would you like to be an astronaut one day yes oh wow so it means that Sally wants to become an astronaut someday, okay? I hope you will become a good astronaut. Are you not scared to become an astronaut, Sally? You're not scared to yes. become an astronaut? You really no, want to no. become an astronaut or you're scared? Yes. I'm really good at the astronaut. Oh, wow. Scared. I'm not scared. I'm not scared, teacher. Oh, you really want to be an astronaut someday? Like teacher Anne. Teacher Anne wants to be a scientist. Oh, my God. Okay. Why? Why you want to be a scientist? I want to discover more about science, you know? Like how plants, how, okay how uh, plants grow exactly, like what are the smallest insects, what are the landforms and different things. But I guess it's so hard. So actually, teacher Anne really wants to become a journalist when I was young, okay? But uh, to become a journalist needs to have a lot of money, but we don't have money. So that's the reason why teacher Anne is is studying to become a teacher. Now I will ask you, what is the name of the planet where we live? It's the Earth. The Earth. Earth. Okay. 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 The answer is Earth. How many planets move around and around the sun? It's the eight planets. There are eight planets okay what does our planet earth looks like 
from the space? It's the blue and the white ball. It looks blue and white ball. Okay, so if we are astronauts, we can probably see what's the color of our planet. Okay, we can probably show the difference of our planet Earth and the other planet. So to remember that our planet Earth is only the planet who has human living in it. Okay, so we are in the planet Earth. So many people living in the planet Earth. Okay. So there's so many people, okay? Okay. Okay, Mary. Okay, Sally. Okay, so you understand yes. now. So. Now we look at our planet, the beautiful planet earth okay look at that it's so beautiful you will see that one okay so you have here the sun this is the realistic planet we have here okay. our planet earth is like this this one ice it's color blue red oh the ring planet saturn call it as the ring planet Pluto, Pluto is not existed nowadays. It is already gone. We don't know where because Pluto is considered the farthest planet, the far, farthest planet. It's very far from the sun. That is why Pluto planet is very, it is very dark. Very? Dark, very dark because it is far from the sun. There is no moon, so that's why it's a dark planet. Look at this one, the Jupiter. Jupiter is the biggest planet. But what we have uh, considered as the ring planet or the beautiful planet is Saturn. It is next to Jupiter. Jupiter is the last planet and the biggest. Next, the one is Saturn. And look up here, the sun. Okay, The sun is... Oh my God, it's very hot. The sun is the planet who is very hot, as in totally hot. It's a hot planet. Okay. It's considered as the hot planet. We have here the planet vocabulary. Okay, I don't oh, the term here. You know that you know how to read Vietnamese? Uh, I don't know. Mars Sauha. Okay. Is this correct? Um, can you read something? Can you read for me? Yeah, I will read the Vietnamese. Okay, Mars. Oh, you listen, teacher. Mars Sauha. <laughs> Saturn. It's South Pole. Okay. Job. It's very good. <coughs> very good. Very good. Jupiter. It's Salmok. Uh, Luto, it's Sao Diem Bong. Sao Diem Bong. Okay, Venus. Sao Kim. Teacher Anne, can you yes. read again? I will, uh, I will, um, I will uh, wreck it again. Read it, read it, read it. Wow, you let teacher Anne read the Vietnamese word. Okay, teacher Anne actually don't know how to read it properly. The pronunciation is different from what you've been doing. Okay, first one, we have the Mars. Okay, Mars is Sao Hua. Okay, Saturn, Sao Tua. Aha, <laughs> teacher. Next, Jupiter. Jupiter is considered as the biggest planet. It's Sao Mok. Oh, next is Pluto. Pluto is Sao Diem Vorong. Sao Diem Vong. Okay. Next. Pluto. So good. Actually, Pluto is not around nowadays because it is already gone. We don't know why. Probably because Pluto is very far from the sun. Next is Mercury. Okay. Uh, sorry, it's Venus. 
Venus is Sao Kim. Next, we have yes. Mercury. Mercury is Sao Toy. Oh, Sao Toy. I didn't know how to read it properly. Next. But I, but I say I like your read. It's good. You like reading. Very okay. good. Next is Uranus. Uranus is Sao Bien Vong. Sao Bien Vong. Okay, next one is uh, Neptune. Uh, Neptune is Sao Hai Vong. Sao Hai Vong. So, okay, I don't know so where is the earth. Okay, okay, so those are the names, the Vietnamese terms of the different planets. Okay. On the next day, on the next lesson, we're going to continue and do this listening and writing the names of the planet. So you need to be familiar with all the planets before we're going to study this one. Okay? Okay. Okay, Sally girl. Oh, you record my name. I guess we Okay. Okay, can I hear it? Okay, you will check it's okay. Sao Bien, <laughs> Sao Kim. Saturn, Sao Tuo, Aha. Next, Jupiter. Jupiter is considered as the biggest planet. It's Sao Mok. You recorded your aunt's voice. My back is really. Okay. That's so good. Yeah. Okay. Next. 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 Next.